Assalamu alaikum. I am Muhammad Bigta Susan. Welcome you to today's class. Today we will learn geometry. Before starting new lesson, we will we will review the previous lesson. See what type of angle is this? Yes, you are right. This is right angle. It's measure exactly 90 degrees. See the another picture. What type of angle is this? Acute angle. Yes, because it is measure less than 90 degree. See this. What type of angle is this? Yes, you are right. It is a straight angle because it's measure exactly 180 degree. Thank you. You are brilliant. You can give the correct answer. Now, we will go for new lesson. See the picture. Can you guess which part of the geometry we learn today? Yes. Triangle. What is triangle? What is triangle? Can you guess? A figure which is bounded by three line segment is called triangle. See one side, another side, and three side. This three side make a figure. It is a triangle. So we can draw a triangle like this way. See. One line segment, another line segment, and make a triangle. Now we can tell here A, B, C. This is a triangle. The triangle shape can be different for the shape, size, and the different of different size of angle. There are different types of triangle. First, we will learn according to the side. According to the side, there are three types of triangle. One, equilateral triangle. Two, isosceles triangle. Three, scaling triangle. Today, we will learn equilateral triangle first. Equilateral, the word is telling the definition. Equal and all sides. So what will be the definition of equilateral? A triangle whose all sides are equal is called equilateral triangle. Here, <coughs> I am repeating again. A triangle whose all sides are equal is called equilateral triangle. So, I will draw it right now. You must follow me after finishing my video, then you will try to draw it. First is equilateral triangle. Equilateral triangle. We will draw the equilateral triangle first. We have to draw a straight line in down. We have to give its name B C and be very careful. Point note the point. Now with the compass, we have to measure the length of B C and it should be. Exactly. Follow B, C. B and C exactly the length we have to take it. Equal length. Its name is equilateral. See, here exactly we will draw on arc upper side of the B, C. From the C point 
again we will take the same length and we will draw another arc over the other arc. Now we got a joining point. We will give its name A. What is the name of it? A. I got three point A, B, C. Now we will add it. We will add it and be very careful. It, you should confirm it. The, uh, it is on the point or not. This is a B. I have joined now. Again, I will join A and C. Follow it. A and C. Now you become equilateral. This side, this side, this side. All sides are equal. That is why it is equilateral. It has another information is all three angles are equal. All three angles are equal. Now I will write here. Here triangle sign ABC is a equilateral triangle. Here ABC is an equilateral triangle. Have you understood? Yes. Now isosceles triangle. In this word iso. Iso means two. So our definition will be very easy. A triangle whose two sides are equal is called an isosceles triangle. Is called an isosceles triangle. Again I am repeating. A triangle whose two sides are equal is called an isosceles triangle. Now we will learn how to draw. Same way we will draw a down line first. One line segment. Follow me. One line segment. We can give its name A, sorry, B and C. Now, now with the compass, we will set up the compass before that. Now we will take, we will point out it. Point out. Now we will draw it. Take the length, more length of BC. We will take more. Then we will give on arc. On arc in over of the BC. Now from the BC side, we will draw same with the same length that we have taken earlier. Another length. Now we will we will mark as a point A. Now we got A B C. We will draw this on we will add A B first. A and B. We we'll draw it A and B. Then we we'll draw B at a and C. Be very careful why you will draw. It should connect the point. Now we can see this and this arms are equal. So we can write in down here here triangle sign ABC is an isosceles triangle. Have you understood isosceles triangle? Again I am repeating. <coughs> A triangle whose two sides are equal is called an isosceles triangle. It has another property. Two angles also equal. Two angles are also equal. Now we will learn a scaling triangle. A scaling, the meaning of this word is not equal any side. Different length. So, the definition will be a triangle whose has different length of sight is called a scalar triangle. Again, I am repeating the definition. A triangle whose has different length of sight is called a scalar triangle. That means the three sides has different length. Now, how to draw? Let's 
draw the triangle see different length you only to measure just draw this one then bigger than this line here then add it add it it is it is a scalene triangle we can give its name a b c now we will write it down here a b c is a is a scalene triangle here again i am telling the definition a triangle whose has different length of side is called a scalene triangle it has different <coughs> length of this three side look it is small then this one is bigger than this one then more bigger than this one thus that means these three line segment are different length that is called called scalene triangle clear have you understood how to draw please draw it thank you now now i will repeat all three triangles first one is equilateral triangle equilateral triangle equilateral triangle equal on one side this word if you keep in your mind then it will be easy for you a triangle whose all sides are equal is called an equilateral triangle see the figure thank you now isosceles triangle isosceles triangle is triangle isosceles is two so our definition will be a triangle whose two sides are equal is called an isosceles triangle see the figure two sides are equal Then down we will write here ABC is an isosceles triangle. Now a scalene triangle, a triangle which has different length of side is called a isosceles. Sorry, scalene triangle. You look, see the figure. It is a scalene triangle. Clear? So after finishing this class, you will draw. and you will write the definition properly in your copy so i have understood the things today we have learned today we have learned the definition of triangle then according to the side of there are three types of triangle one equilateral triangle two isosceles triangle Three is current triangle. Have understood, and we have learned how to draw. Next class, we will learn the triangle according to the angle. Clear? Today, this is the Home last up. time. Class is over. Thank you for watching this class. I hope you will practice at your home. Then you will be able to tell or write all the definition. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum.